Hi, guys, welcome back to my channel in this videos, let's take a look inside MedLife Stadium when New York Jets lose Aaron Rodgers to early injury before stunning Buffalo Bills in overtime. Aaron Rodgers was helped off by trainers four minutes into his competitive New York debut after suffering an injury while being sacked by Leonard Floyd, head coach Robert Sala admitted afterwards, it's not good, after seeing his side beat the Buffalo Bills in overtime. Aaron Rodgers suffered a game and potentially season-ending Achilles injury just four plays into his debut before his New York Jets went on to stun the Buffalo Bills 22-16 in overtime after rookie Xavier Deepson's 65-yard punt return for a game-winning touchdown on Monday night. Rodgers, who arrived this offseason via a trade from the Green Bay Packers, fell awkwardly on his left leg after a sack from Leonard Floyd four minutes in requiring help to the sideline as Zach Wilson entered at quarterback for the rest of the game. The Jets forced four turnovers from Bills quarterback Josh Allen during a sloppy season opener for Sean McDermott's team, Jordan Whitehead coming up with three interceptions. With the game tied, Michael Clemens forced a fumble by Allen that was recovered by Quinn and Williams, setting up Greg Zurline's third field goal, a 30-yarder, with 1.48 remaining to put the Jets ahead for the first time. Buffalo would go three and out to start overtime, Deepson fielding Sam Martin's ensuing 42-yard punt and finding green grass down the left sideline to scurry away for a game-winning touchdown to prompt wild celebrations from teammates on the sideline. 
Sala was there to swarm Deepson, an undrafted rookie from Stephen F. Austin who made the team out of training camp. Meanwhile, Allen tied a career high with his four turnovers and fell to 0-5 to five in overtime, including playoff games. The Jets had tied it at 13 with 4.55 left on an acrobatic catch by Garrett Wilson, who tipped Wilson's pass to himself with his right hand, and Tredavious White draped all over him, and corralled the ball as he fell on his back in the end zone. Rodgers had entered the night as new hope for a Jets franchise seeking a first Super Bowl since the Joe Namath-led team of 1968. The Jets acquired Rodgers along with the no-15 overall pick and a fifth rounder in this year's draft for the 13th overall pick, a second rounder, sixth rounder and conditional 2024 second round pick with the Packers, where the 39-year-old had spent the first 18 seasons of his career. <laughs> 